kicked off in style with Daisy's Ubuntu girls becoming moving targets As for her Hakuna most Matata. senior subordinate. As the breeding season heats up in the Kalahari, family changes are under Those departing must make smart choices. ...the end of her pregnancy and is going to need all the babysitting help she can get with her third litter this year. And if she's been seduced by a rover, she could also be pregnant. But could she really consider giving treacherous Pandy another chance? ...to hang out for every frisky young buck on the manor. But woe betide anyone who falls... It's all getting a bit much. But it's her son, Mikkel, who hits the jet. Together, this foursome has enormous potential. Him. The chemistry just isn't there. Leaving this, there'll be no pandering to Pandy. Oh. Job done, Swift resumes the day's other priorities. Sort is preoccupying the last of Daisy's missing daughters, the native. Father, a few more. Unfortunately, the native. He's surrounded by spring fever. As long as Ricky doesn't challenge her, Wren will most likely be crowned leader. The biggest threat she faces is not from rovers, but from her closest kin. 